The biopsychosocial model of pain is really taking chronic pain patients, which are very complex, and giving them a very unique personalized treatment approach. Obviously, their pain is not just related to what's going on in their body, but it's also related to their psychological and emotional state, as well as their social state, which is their setting, their job, their family system. So the concept is really that we can't just treat pain patients with a medication. We also have to look at their lifestyle and then integrate certain practices so that they actually have lifelong changes. First of all, we have a opioid epidemic. We have many people that are overdosing on opioids despite the fact that we're trying to decrease opioids. 50 million people with chronic pain, 300 million people with depression, more people are taking antidepressants and benzodiazepines for depression and anxiety, yet we have more and more people who are not well. And I think a lot of this comes from chronic stress and from unresolved trauma. And so there's a huge mental health crisis and we have an opioid epidemic and we really just don't have good solutions right now. And I think that if we're able to identify people's trauma and treat it and also try to control people's stress level, then we'll have a lot less chronic pain.